What is up, beautiful people? TJ here with another episode. Today, me and April are going to be venturing into the unknown. Yes, we are going to be doing some retail arbitrage and trying to find some secret clearance at our local Walmart or a couple of our local Walmarts. Now, this video was filmed over a two day, a two day span. So yesterday and today, today, which is Saturday, yesterday being Friday. And uh, we're gonna see if we can find some super deals. Now, this is something that we have not done before. However, we've talked about wanting to do this for quite a while. So let's see if we can find some awesome deals at a local Walmart. All right, so let me set the stage as to where we're at and what we're gonna do. Um, the first day, I'm gonna go by myself and see if I can find some stuff. I did find a couple of items. Um, we'll talk a little bit about the items while we're at the store, and then we'll come back here and I'll show you, I'll do a breakdown of everything that I found, and I'll also give you a short tutorial of how we scan stuff, and kind of look at the pricing and stuff like that. So let's get on over to the Walmart. All right, so the first thing I wanted to look at while I was here was these cry cut or cricket, whatever you want to call these things. Um, they were three dollars. They was actually showing for three dollars, and the uh, they was marked down from five dollars. So when I scanned these on the app, uh, the Amazon app, they was actually selling for about twelve dollars, twelve dollars and ninety eight cent for a couple of them, the different styles and stuff. This actual style right here goes for a little bit more. Uh, than some of the plain styles. Um, but yeah, we can sell these for $13. Okay, so I think I ended up getting, I don't know, six of these, seven of these. They were $3 a piece. I'm gonna make a profit of about seven. Look at all this junk I got back here in the back. <laughs> I'm gonna make uh, about $7 per one after fees and everything on uh, been by Amazon. So I'm gonna track this and see how much I can make. I am gonna go over to my other Walmart and see if I can find anything since I'm not doing anything else. And uh, I'll see y'all here in a minute. It's the only thing that I found, $7. Showing it was $14.88. Um, and it's actually going for about $30 or $40. So I'm gonna grab this. All these Funko Pops down here. Just Dragon Ball Z stuff. This is actually cool. It's full big pen. Uh, but they're only going for about what they're selling for there, about 40 bucks. They got a couple of smaller ones here. It's pretty cool. And there was a ton of games, even some PlayStation 5 games over here. I scanned all of them, I didn't see anything. All right, so he had to go in and manually change them because it wasn't ringing up as uh, seven dollars. But as you can see right here, he changed the price. That was fourteen eighty eight. That's what extra says on the front fourteen eighty eight, but it had a seven dollars sticker on it. Um, but these are selling for like thirty or forty dollars online. So um, these are these are selling for about thirty dollars. This other one, I don't even know who this person is, but hopefully we can make a nice little profit on it. All right, so today I'm looking for a couple of deals that I saw online at my local Walmart. I'm actually going to Walmart and see if they have these items uh, available. A couple of them are like some dead bolts, some electronic dead bolts. Um, we sell those quite a bit on, you know, that I get from a bin store. So hopefully I can get these for a very, very good price. My uh, BrickSeek app said there was a couple available. So I'm gonna go over here and see if they got some. y'all we are at the walmart april just fresh off of work i know <laughs> we scanned this stuff uh so we found three things so far in the clearance aisle this is our clearance aisle um we got that. this is a web root thing it's showing for 4.97 but then i scanned it april scanned it and it's scanned it for a dollar so we okay. said this for about 12 dollars online which don't seem like a lot but it's only gonna cost what three dollars to ship this right um so we'll make some money on that this is the big item yeah it's the big this, one the, this the thing right here y'all see what it is yeah windows 10 home let's see how much it's selling what it say yeah what it say 87 57 <laughs> allegedly allegedly <laughs> all right so look we gonna scan it y'all see me live scan in here 
$13. So that's a good price for that. Then this one, which is some sort of if I me stick, I don't even know what that is. Virus removal device. So we'll scan that one. Yeah, that was $26. And it is scanning for five bones. So we're gonna keep on going, keep on scanning some stuff. Okay, we have um Oh y'all, excuse me. <laughs> we uh we got some stuff. I'm gonna flip around so y'all can see what kind of stuff that we got. Um so we got these Mr. Potato Heads. I know these was like a big thing because they were gonna be discontinued. They was only five dollars. Mm -hmm. So they are scanning for five dollars. So we're gonna go ahead and grab those just in case. Yeah. Um this but these right here, how much did they show they up for? Listed um they said the clearance was twenty two dollars. Yeah. And then so I'll just scan it. Maybe I might scan it. So they're actually scanning for five dollars. Um, so we got all of those. I think it's uh, what four of them. Yeah, we got mm -hmm. four of those. And then this one right here, these was listed. These are um, clearance. It was like seventeen dollars yeah. or something. Yeah, but they were scanning um, for I think a dollar fifty. Yeah, let's scan them. Yeah. Yeah. So I mean, for dollar fifty, you can't beat that. I mean. Oh. It's brand new product and even too. for like Q4. Oh, did we get that one? Yeah. Yeah, this one right here. Uh, that one right there. Yeah, this one right here. Um, they were scanning for a dollar, I think. Yep, they were scanning for a buck. So even for like Q4 setting up with the toys and stuff, I mean, for a dollar fifty, you can't be bad. <laughs> so we're gonna go to the electronic section and see if we can find anything else. All right, guys, we are scanning. We are at the second Walmart of the day. We're gonna go in here to see if we can find some hidden clearance. Yeah. Um, we did pretty good at the first store. I don't know exactly what the profit is that we got from everything and all this stuff, in, but no, yeah. some most of the stuff Great in back. Great stuff back there. Um, but we are gonna try to see if we can find some similar deals or maybe some better deals. Mm -hmm. And uh, we think we paid what seventy one dollars for all that stuff, and yeah, I think it was, and we did pretty good. Yes, yeah, one item in that bag that pays for the whole load. That pays for the whole load. So, so we are gonna get in here and get to scanning. All right, so not so good at the uh, this yeah. Tiftonia. It's nice out here though. Look at this, is. look, this is beautiful set. It's, it's hot. It's hot, that's <laughs> what it is. Yeah, so we didn't do too well. I'm gonna show y'all a couple items that we got. And then uh, at the end, well, I'll show you exactly what we think we're gonna make from stuff. All right, so the only thing that we found at this store was these uh, cry cut cricket, what do you wanna call them? Uh, we're gonna make about $6, a little bit over $6 per one. And we got 10 of these. Um, so that's $60 right there. And then we got, we got these, the mates, like uh, Justin was saying, <laughs> these are the mates, the Mrs. Potato Heads for the Mrs. Potato Heads that we got. So those $5 a the piece, we'll lock those together and, um, and and get those sold. And if the price is, is not where it needs to be right now, it will be at some point. So we'll have those available. So I think we got um, three sets of two. We do. And yeah. then we got one but just by itself, so. All right. All right. So that was actually really fun. I'm gonna go through and I'm gonna show y'all everything that we've got. And I think, you know, I think it's going to be pretty surprising. Um, so let's just start here. We did get this, um, these frozen Elsa dolls. We actually got four of these. I'm not gonna pick them up, but they're somewhere. Where are they? Right here. We got four of these. Um, these actually scanned for a dollar and fifty cents. So it was. This was a hidden clearance because this was lower than what the advertised price was. But uh, for these, we got four of them, and I calculated based on the sold comps and with everything, we should profit around eight dollars for each one of them. We have four of them, so that's gonna be thirty-two dollars. Um, this one was actually a, a little bit of a surprise. I was just going around and, and just perusing and looking for everything. This was kind of misplaced. It's on the shelf somewhere. 
I saw I had a tag on it. I had a tag on it for $8.85. I scanned it. It actually was $3. Um, so this is selling for around $20 to $25. Um, so I'll say we're going to profit around $11 for this. This was the big winner for just for one item. So this was the Windows 10 Home. Um, it's actually $140. It was clearance down to $87, but it scanned at $13. $13. So I saw this on BrickSeek. That is one one of the things that I used before I went was I looked at BrickSeek. BrickSeek is not a, uh, it's just a tool for you to use. So you can't go, and if it says they have five of these in the store, it doesn't mean that you're going to go into the store and it's going to have five sitting on the display shelf. Um, it's not, it, it's a pretty accurate in terms of telling you the type of items that are going to be there, but you can't just take that and say, okay, this is what's going to be in the store. So it did say that this was on sale for $13. I didn't think I was going to be able to find none, but there was, lo and behold, it was one in our uh, bin. So this one, we cannot sell on Amazon, but the Amazon price is $129, which is like super awesome. Uh, we are going to have to sell this on eBay, uh, but they're going all day on e eBay for $80 to $85. So uh, with shipping and fees and everything, it'll be about $61 profit for this Windows 10 Home. And those sell pretty fast. All right, then we got a, uh, we're going to do this with uh, FBA. So we're going to send this in to Amazon. Um, so Amazon calculates all the fees and everything once you ship it to it. Um, we're going to make a profit about $11.55 for this. This did scan uh, for $5. It had a tag on it for $26.48, as you can, you might be able to see right there. Uh, but actually, when we scanned it, it actually was $5. So we paid five bucks for that. We're going to profit $11. Uh, and then we got these two little dolls here. There's a scary one. There's a scary one. Exorcist. And then this Star Trek one. Um, and these are this one will profit around $12 for, and this one will profit for around $11. We can send both of these in uh, to Amazon. So we're going to look and see if we want to hold on to these closer to like Christmas time or if we're going to sell these right now. These are more like collector's items versus like Christmas kind of gifts. Um, but I, I think conservatively we can make 12 for this one, 11 for this one. And then last on this side is this web root thing. Uh, it had a price on it for $4.97. It actually scanned for $1. So we paid a buck for this. These are selling for about $15 on eBay and uh, we'll profit around $9.50 for this. All right, so then we got the Mrs. Potato Heads. We actually got Mr. Potato Heads and Mrs. Potato Heads on. So we did get the pair. So these pairs do sell for around 20 to $25 right now. We're gonna actually hold on to these because I think these are gonna appreciate in value um, because I don't think they're gonna make, they're gonna be making these or they're not gonna make one of them or something. Something's going on with the Mr. Potato Head. If y'all know what's going on with the Mr. Potato Head and Mr. Potato Head, put it down in the comment section below. Either way, right now we can get around $25 for the pair, but we are gonna hold on to them because I think these will go for a lot higher. I did price them based on what we can get right now. And um, we have three pairs of two, so three pairs of a Mr. and Mrs. Potato Head. And uh, we paid $10 for the pair, that was $5 a piece. And we think we're gonna get around um, $5.50 for the pair. That don't sound like a lot of money right now, but I think that will increase over time because these will go for um, a lot more than what they're going for right now. All right, so we got a ton of these. Um, I actually got some yesterday when I went by myself and then me and April picked up a couple more today. These were on sale um, for, they were $5, then they went down to $3. Um, but these are actually selling on Amazon for about $13. So we're gonna send all these into Amazon um, and we're gonna profit about $6.16 per one uh, sold. And I think we have, I don't know how many we got. We've got 18 of them. So uh, that's gonna be about $110 for all of these. Now these are gonna be sellers. They they had a pretty decent sales rank. Um, so hopefully they do start selling pretty quickly, but we're gonna get these sent in uh, on Monday. We're gonna track the sales over the next 30 days and see how we do with these, uh, whatever these are. These are premium vinyl cricket, crack cut. I don't know how you pronounce that. Cricket crack cut, you know what I'm talking about. All right, and last but not least, we did get these Frozen 2, um, it has all the characters or most of the characters from Frozen 2. These, okay, where is it? These was actually $5. Oh my God, I can't believe we got these for five bucks. So these right now are selling for about $25 um, a piece, but I think that we're gonna hold on to these 
more towards Christmas time. And I think we'll get a lot more for these like during Q4. Um, so I did just conservative pricing of what we can get right now. Um, and I think we're going to profit around $17 for these because right now they're going for $25 like plus shipping on eBay. Um, so that's going to be around $80 for all four of these. We got four. We did pick up four of these. So all in all, um, profit in our pocket. If we sell everything, it's going to be three hundred and fifty-four dollars and fifty-five cents. Now, I think that was a pretty good day, especially because me and April had like an awesome time doing this. This was like so fun. Uh, we're probably going to try to do this every week. Um, I had I literally live like three minutes away from the Walmart, so I can go over there and check out the clearance. I'm over there like almost every day, and you know April's over there almost every day anyway too. <laughs> um, so we're going to go through and peruse the the clearance. Um, the way that we do the clearance is you pull up the Walmart app, you know, it's just the, the regular Walmart app and you can click on shop this store and what it actually do if you're at the store It will take your GPS location and find the store that you're at and then you'll click on the uh, the top right And it's like a little barcode icon you click on that it'll pull up the barcode icon And then so you can scan this barcode on the front. This is actually the clearance barcode Sometimes some stores won't have this clearance barcode. I actually saw that our store one of them they marked through the clearance barcode so you could not scan the clearance barcode so we did have to scan this barcode on the back either one of them will give you a price i don't know if it's going to be the right price or if it's going to be <laughs> just any price but you can scan uh either one of these and in this instance like both sides read the same they both said you know that this was five dollars so um you can scan these through the glass um if you if you're like trying to get games and stuff like that, we didn't have too many games. We did scan the games. We didn't see anything um, like really crazy, so we didn't pick up any of the games. But um, always, always, always just scan these. Even if you see this like this twenty six dollars, um, scan it anyway because like I said, we scanned this. We saw this for twenty six dollars. Scan it and it scanned for five. Um, you know, this was eight dollars and it scanned for three. So you can don't look at the price and get deterred by the price because we would have passed this up for eighty seven dollars. I'm not going to pay eighty seven dollars for this to resell to somebody um but for 13 dollars hell yeah <laughs> i'm going to every day um so like i said we're going to be doing more of these probably we'll try to do a couple of these a week or at least one of these a week um because like i said this was fun um and it, we did make some money and we're going to track this this is going to be our next challenge so the last challenge was you know doing the the new store this right here is going to be a retail arbitrage uh, challenge and we're going to track this throughout the month and hopefully it's going to be a new way where we can source items and some new content that we can bring to you guys so if you like these types of videos please like share and subscribe really appreciate it also hit that bell icon so you get notifications whenever we release new videos and we will see you guys on the next one peace